UFC Fight Night heads to Satama, Japan on Friday with the light heavyweight clash at the top of the billing. Japanese veteran Yoshin Akami returns to the UFC as a late replacement for the injured Mauricio Shogun Rua to take on Avans St. Priux in the night's headliner. It's a big re-entry for Akami against the number 6 ranked 205-pounder in the world, having been competing in smaller promotions since 2013. Avans St. Priux, 2010-0, versus Yoshin Thunder Akami, 32-8-0. Light heavyweight John Jones' recent drug test failure leaves the UFC's light heavyweight division in as weak a state as it has ever been. But that also means the path to the title is a relatively short one. Ovens St. Priux, who has gone five rounds with Jones in the past, will know an emphatic main event victory will put him right amongst the division's top contenders. And the test he is up against has become a more straightforward one after Brazilian legend Shogun's late withdrawal and steady faces 36-year-old Akami, who steps up in weight to make his return to the world's premier mixed martial arts promotion. Akami, who holds wins over the likes of Anderson Silva and Hector Lombard, shouldn't be counted out, however, with a grinding style that could be well suited to this matchup. Riding a four-fight win streak. The hometown fighter will have the crowd on his side in the famous Super Arena, but will be on the wrong side in terms of strength and power. St. Priux, a former pro footballer, is looking to return to winning ways in his last bout after three consecutive losses and should use his size and athleticism to do the same here. Claudia Gadilha, a 15-2-0, v. Jessica Andrade, 16-6-0. Strawweight The co-main event will see two of the best strawweights in the world go head-to-head, -head, as fellow Brazilians Claudia Gadilha and Jessica Andrade collide. Gadilha has established herself as the second-best fighter the division has to offer, behind imperious champion Joanna Jadrejcik, with many, including Andrade, in the conversation for third place. Unfortunately for Gadilha, she already has two narrow losses to the pole, and third chances in the UFC are a rarity. But the 28 year old has won back to back bouts, and a third victory on the bounce will certainly put pressure on matchmakers. To do so, she must get past the always game Andrade, who comes off a decision defeat to Jadrejcik of her own, albeit a convincing one. It promises to be an intriguing clash of styles with Gidhella famed for her strength and ability to ragdoll her opponents to the mat and Andrade a dangerous power puncher with effective grappling.